This is the place where I built my boat. In March last year, it's about the same time, I finished building my Gen 15, my first boat for that year. I'm a little bit behind this year because the weather is a little bit cold. In about two weeks, the weather will be warmer and I can start working outdoor. Let's take a look at what I'm going to build. I searched Google for a 12 feet long seat on top kayak. And I like the look of this one. This is my 20th design and I will call it Gen 20. I will modify the folding mechanism based on the design of my Gen 18 and make the hinge design much stronger and lighter by removing the extra top deck found on my Gen 18. The shape of the hull will be somewhat like this for better stability. I then partitioned the boat into three sections and the boat can be fit into a 4 feet by 8 feet foam. The three section boat, because they are extra hinges, will increase the overall weight of the boat. But if I only build a boat with two sections, that is six feet long for each section, the design and build will be much faster and it should be lighter too. The best part is I can still cut two sections on this four feet by eight feet foam. This boat when folded at six feet long and I cannot fit that into my small yellow car. But I can still fit that inside my SUV. Now I try a little bit. I actually can stretch the bow into six and a half feet long per section to come up with a 13 feet long boat. Or maybe even longer bow into seven feet section that will come up with a 14 feet long boat. For now I will stay with 12 feet long boat because if I put a sail on it, I will be able to avoid registering the boat as a sailboat in the state of Oregon. I'm building a jig to cut the foam and I will share the progress of building this boat in my next video. If you find this video interesting, please support my channel by giving me a like and subscribe to my channel also. Thank you. See you again.